Hey all, get hyped, get excited, because I'm here with another reaction. Hit that subscribe button to join the Chairview family. Leave a like, a comment, suggest other stuff for me to react to down below. Today, we get entertained with tokens. Hi, J. Cole. We had a song to Will Smith by Joyner Lucas. We now have Tom McDonald's song to Eminem with his expensive as hell beat. But now, a major contender has entered the game. It's Token. If you've slept on Token until now, well, you really need to look him up. Token fell off the earth a bit when he signed with a label and started his own sub-label, but he's back releasing tracks again. I'm watching the people I know that I'm better than elevate to a height bigger than mine. The only reason you got you a buzz because none of your competition even trying. They don't put me in no rap conversation, but now I ain't tripping. It's coming in time. Happy you had you a moment, but Token back focus to show them you don't got a flow cold in the mind. Okay, so like, Token, I came in a couple years late, but I uh, was with the Token train from the very beginning. I was on board with him. I loved what he was doing. And so let's look at some of the words on this uh, song here. He's watching the people that he knows that he feels he's better than get more fame and get more popularity than him. But he's saying that he's barely even putting an effort in and that's why you guys are doing so well. And that he's saying that currently no one's talking about him when they talk about rap music, but that's simply not true. And, uh, yeah, Token did go away for a while, and I thought that when he signed to a major label and started his own label, Never Too Different, I thought, gee, it's weird that Token hasn't published anything in a while, but uh, he's been working hard, so yeah. My flow over the rhyme, my flow open their mind like the doom DMT. I'm the Joe Rogan the rhyme, but don't choke in the lines. You throw closer, cause I'm trying to bring smoke like the poke toes in a time. And they know no one's close when I go toe to toe. So when I give my whole glow moment to shine, that is the most amazing line I've ever heard. Um, I can't bop and move like most people physically, but I'm enjoying the song. But the best line ever is My flows are opening their mind like they're doing DMT. I'm the Joe Rogan of rhyme. Don't choke on the lines as in, you know, another certain drug. <laughs> and it's pretty genius. I'm trying to bring smoke like the Pope's chosen in time. That's another line that when they choose the new Pope in the Vatican, smoke is coming out and everything else when they make that decision. Oh, and by the way, if you want to just watch the entire video without interruption, then you should go and watch Token's video. I'm going to pause it and I'm going to talk about it because that's what these reaction channels are for. Anyway. Act like they can't hear me, Hulk Hogan inside. Take it as a lesson. J. Cole drop now, I'm waiting on the Kendrick and if Drizzy don't deliver, then I'll take it as a message. Gotta put in work, I gotta make it as a legend, ain't waiting for the credit. So he's saying there basically that he's been waiting for all these albums. He's been waiting for the Drake album and the Kendrick Lamar album. And he's saying that he's not going to wait for them. He's going to become his own legend in that. He doesn't have to wait on them to make great music. He's going to be making it himself. Set the record, I'm blessed today. The epidemic was just a phase. A better level of renegade. I'm Eminem when he met with Jay. And tell Lenny to get me paid. This ain't no cryptocurrency, but the real token. Probably best investment they ever made, ho. Talking down to me like I ain't on a level yet. I bet I sell double tickets on the road. The comparison to cryptocurrency when his name is Token is pretty ingenious. He calls everyone a ho all the time. And, uh... Yeah, everyone's talking down to him, uh, underestimating what he's capable of, and he's just trying to show that he's capable of so much more than they're giving him credit for. And of course, he's always being compared to Eminem, so he might as well talk about that comparison in the song. I told him not to bring his pistol with him, but he's stuck up in his ways, and that's just how it goes. And it kind of do remind me of myself, because I'm about to drop a hit, but still want to hit him with that old flow. Get him every day wine, better with time. I'm in a different cycle. Token, a whole different zone. Oh, it's a moment to hold. I like the line there of, uh, I told him not to bring his pistol, but he's stuck in his ways. And it reminds me of myself, because I'm about to drop a hit. <laughs> he's saying that, uh, despite his young age, that he's a legend already, and, um, Token's music is full of this kind of thing, this braggadocious flow that he does. But he also has messages in his songs. But this one is just for fun, like most of his freestyles. But his freestyles, I think, are still amazing. Cole, you just throw me the bone. I beat all beats you condone. I treat my seat like a throne. I keep like three different hoes. I keep my kids in the throat and I leave them each all disowned. I ain't no role model. 
tippy toe with the flow. Oh, God, be quiet. My bitch at home video. Oh, you got to watch her. So in that part, it's pretty clear that uh, Token is looking for that collab. And his collabs that he's had in the past are pretty amazing. You gotta love that line he gives with a little entendre there. Be absolutely moving past the bracket. You assume I'm actually belonging it, but I got a sponsorship like do the student athlete. Fuck this beat, I need some action. Pick the casket, I'm the kid to pack it in. Kill the track and give it back again like shit's an accident. My bad, I'm babbling back to the topic. I heard Token's about to drop a project, God, it's nostalgic. I love how he's got this line about um, how nostalgic it is to hear a project from Token as if he's been rapping for 20 years when it really hasn't been all that long. It's been like, what? I don't know, seven or eight, something like that. But it does feel like it's been a while, and I'm glad to have him back. It get awkward when they throw me in a boat with fucking so-and-so. Knowing that I let their moment go, but now I'm on my own. My vocal tone tell me, calm it down, relax, dog. You proved enough to him. Just give him the tracks. And yeah, Token's got nothing to prove at this point. He's already shown that he's a versatile rapper, and that he's going to do well in the industry, and that he's not going anywhere. He's talking about being thrown in the same boat as so-and-so, which they did comparing him to like NF and Eminem and Tom McDonald, all those people. And then he said, knowing that I let their moment go. Basically, they were talking to him, calling him the new Eminem, trying to get him to sign and everything. And that he said no, that... At first, he actually said no to them when the major labels came knocking. Okay, I gotta get back. Cool, my name on the map. That belong on a plaque too. Fact, the fact is feeling this past through. True, coming to bat. Ooh, it's me, it's T. It's fucking a whole industry if they don't give me the key. Never too different. You can tell in all of Token's videos that he's having fun and he's enjoying himself. And I'm glad that him getting signed and starting his own label and everything didn't go to his head and that... He's still humble and he's still having fun with it and he's still making the kind of music that he wants to make. Whether you like his music or not, you got to admit he's got a good business acumen and he knows what he's doing. Anyway, let me know down in the comments what you think of Token as a whole and what you thought about this video in particular. <laughs> The bad is your word. The bad is your word. The bad is your word. The bad is your word.